please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Greetings and welcome back to Raising the Vibe. Thank you for joining me for another video. In this video, I would like to talk about the fact that the Polish legislature has passed a bill allowing Polish soldiers to shoot to kill any illegal immigrants, invaders, migrants, whatever it is you wish to call them, attempting to illegally cross the border into Poland. And in fact, the Polish president has said, if you come to Poland, you will be killed. Take a look at this clip. So if you want to come to Poland, you will be killed. I'd like to probably, some of them will watch this uh, interview. <laughs> if you don't want to be killed, do not come to Polish border. If you don't want to be pushed back, do not come to Polish border because we just passed the law that our soldiers, Coast Guard or whatever, they can use live bullets to kill. That is the difference. Now, the Polish president explains the logic of this legislation by saying that if one were to go to Heathrow Airport or Miami International Airport and attempt to run through customs without a passport, according to him, they would be shot. And he said he doesn't see a difference between an airport or a place of that nature and the natural green border. So the Polish soldiers have been empowered to use live bullets to kill. Take a look at this clip where he explains that theory. Because I can see the difference between, let's say, Heathrow Airport, right. uh, Miami International, sure. when you're trying to cross the border without passport, what they would do? They would shoot you. If you would try to run through m m migration, right, the customs, they would shoot you. So what is the difference between Miami International, Heathrow, or any other place, airports, and the green border where they're trying to go, they, they're trying to come through, uh, through the forest? So now Polish, uh, Polish forces services are uh, allowed to use live bullets. And, and it is interesting to look at the comments on that video of the Polish president, because the ones I saw were all in agreement with him. Now there were thousands of comments and I do not purport to have read them all, but the ones I saw were very much in favor of his position. Let's look at a few of them. So here we see people saying things like, I agree with Poland, take care of its own people. Imagine a government protecting its own citizens. Here's one saying they're moving to Poland because it's guarding its borders. We see other comments like this one here saying, this is what it looks like not to be a traitor to your own country. And here we see that Poland has the right to defend the national security of its people and its country. We see a comment loving the Polish president's strength and not apologizing for protecting his country. We see someone else saying that it's a refreshing perspective that he has and asking the UK to take note. Here's another comment saying it's not just the Polish, but many people in the EU feel that way. So overall, people, at least in the comments I saw, tend to be in agreement with him. Illegal immigration is a big concern in Europe, and it is also a central primary concern in America. And what I wonder is, how far would we be willing to go or how far should we be willing to go to protect our borders? Because our country, at least from my perspective, and I've made no secret of this, is being ripped apart at the seams. The whole fabric of our country is being changed by the sheer overwhelming number of illegal immigrants being allowed to come into our country. They're coming in at such large numbers that they're not even attempting to assimilate. What they're doing is changing the nature of our cities and towns, taking over areas, becoming a nuisance in others. And some of it is simply because they're coming here and doing whatever it is they do in their home country, which is not in alignment with the American way. 
I don't know that here in the United States, we need to necessarily shoot to kill any illegal, undocumented uh, person who attempts to cross the borders into our country. But I certainly do think, and I think that many other Americans agree with me, that we need to close our borders. We need to repel illegal, undocumented people trying to come into our country. And we need to get the word out around the globe that enough is enough. We will not be taking any more. And in fact, we're going to send back most of the ones that are here now. That's what I think needs to happen in order for us to save our country. It's not just an American issue, it's an issue in EU as well, but here in America, I think this is a hot button issue for the coming election and may well be the deciding factor in who gets elected president here. As always, thank you for watching. If you're not already a subscriber, I would invite you to subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you as a part of the Raising the Vibe family. Like this video and um, comment and let me know what you think. How should America handle this? Is it the problem that much of us in this country think it is? Much of the Europeans in the EU think it is? Or are we simply over-exaggerating? As always, I love to hear your comments and I look forward to them. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Until then, wherever you are across this globe, stay safe, protect yourself and your family and peace and love, love and light. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel.